Hello, everyone. This is Cheyenne Marling with BC Management, and I want to take an opportunity to highlight one of our newest dashboards that we have uh, that will be going live in January 2022. Um, this dashboard is taken from our current study, which is the Evolving Resiliency Strategy Study, and many of you have already participated, and you will be getting your dashboard along with a complimentary report um, in January or February of 2022. Uh, this study is really focused on some of the changes that have transpired in the last 12 months. So how, have the, how has the executive engagement changed, program integration with other risk disciplines, cyber response, third-party resilience, uh, supply chain resiliency, program governance, program metrics, as well as program automation. But then what's great about this particular um, uh, study that we have, and as a result, the report and dashboards that we're working on, is that it gives you an, a kind of a window of opportunity to look into what's, what are uh, companies planning on for investment change as it pertains to their program. So are they increasing the investment with full-time permanent staff, with emergency notification systems, software automation. Um, our data is initially showing that situational awareness and threat intelligence, you can see is one of the top um, areas of focus as far as an investment change in 2022, in addition to technology to improve recoverability. And then also looking at um, any change within business-focused consulting, as well as IT-focused consulting uh, moving forward in 2022. And why I want to take the opportunity to highlight this great dashboard is that you, the biggest um, point of feedback that we've received as, as it pertains to our reports over the last 20 years is that it's great data, but it's an aggregate report on all the study respondents. But as a study participant, you get this dynamic dashboard that gives you a window into other similar organizations, perhaps from the same industry, or from um, organizations that have the same organizational revenue um, on an annual basis as your organization. So this is an excellent opportunity to really get um, information insight, a window per se, into how your organization may compare to your other peer organizations and looking at some of those evolving resiliency trends. Um, in addition, this report or uh, this dashboard also looks at um, what does your program address if, if the following impact exceeds day-to-day -day management control. So you're looking from everything from fraud, legal issues, um, credit issues, third-party issues. And it also looks and uh, takes a look at which executives care most about your program. Again, this is data that you can get that's relevant to your industry or similar organizations by, by um, organizational revenues. Um, for those of you who are not aware, um, this study will be live through Q3 of 2022, and the reason being is because more and more companies will continue to, to participate in this study throughout 2022, and all new study participants will auto-populate into the dashboards that you've already received. So when you do receive your customized dashboard in January, February 2022, that dashboard is going to continue to uh, elevate in value based on new respondents as they auto-populate into your dashboard. Um, so again, this study is going to be live through Q3 of 2022. It does take 10 minutes and it is completely confidential, meaning that we don't need your company information. You can participate and include your personal email address. The one thing I do emphasize though is if you are an independent consultant, to please participate as a participant of the company you're currently consulting to. Answer every question as if you're a part of that organization because we don't want the data to be skewed. Um, a lot of our organizations, clients, customers really depend on this data to get an understanding of how their program compares to their peers. Um, so as always, I'll include with um, this post where you can find the study, where it's live, where you can find additional studies in addition to the compensation, uh, the BCM trends, our event impact management, and our career and professional development study, study as well. So I hope you enjoy. Please feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions. And as always, we're delighted to help. Thanks so much. Bye.